Novena to the Seven Gifts of the Holy Spirit First Day Holy Spirit, Lord of Light, from your clear celestial height, your pure beaming radiance give. The Holy Spirit Only one thing is important, eternal salvation. Only one thing, therefore, is to be feared, sin. Sin is the result of ignorance, weakness, and indifference. The Holy Spirit is the spirit of light, of strength, and of love. With his sevenfold gifts, he enlightens the mind, strengthens the will, and inflames the heart with love of God. To ensure our salvation, we ought to invoke the Divine Spirit daily, for the Spirit helpeth our infirmity. We know not what we should pray for, as we ought, but the Spirit himself asketh for us. Almighty and eternal God, who hast vouchsafed to regenerate us by water and the Holy Spirit, and hast given us forgiveness of all sins, vouchsafe to send forth from heaven upon us your sevenfold spirit, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and fortitude, the spirit of knowledge and piety, and fill us with the spirit of holy fear. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. On my knees before the great multitude of heavenly witnesses, I offer myself, soul, and body to you, eternal Spirit of God. I adore the brightness of your purity, the unerring keenness of your justice, and the might of your love. You are the strength and light of my soul. In you I live and move and am. I desire never to grieve you by unfaithfulness to grace, and I pray with all my heart to be kept from the smallest sin against you. Mercifully guard my every thought and grant that I may always watch for your light and listen to your voice and follow your gracious inspirations. I cling to you and give myself to you and ask you by your compassion to watch over me in my weakness. Holding the pierced feet of Jesus and looking at his five wounds and trusting in his precious blood and adoring his open side and stricken heart, I implore you, adorable spirit, help 
helper of my infirmity, to keep me in your grace that I may never sin against you. Give me grace, O Holy Spirit, Spirit of the Father and the Son, to say to you always and everywhere, Speak, Lord, for your servant heareth. Amen. O Lord Jesus Christ, who before ascending into heaven did promise to send the Holy Spirit to finish your work in the souls of your apostles and disciples, deign to grant the same Holy Spirit to me, that he may perfect in my soul the work of your grace and your love. Grant me the spirit of wisdom that I may despise the perishable things of this world and aspire only after the things that are eternal. The spirit of understanding to enlighten my mind with the light of your divine truth. The spirit of counsel that I may ever choose the surest way of pleasing God and gaining heaven. The spirit of fortitude that I may bear my cross with you and that I may overcome with courage all the obstacles that oppose my salvation. The spirit of knowledge that I may know God and know myself and grow perfect in the science of the saints. The spirit of piety that I may find the service of God sweet and amiable and the spirit of fear that I may be filled with a loving reverence towards God and may dread in any way to displease Him. Mark me, dear Lord, with the sign of your true disciples and animate me in all things with your spirit. Amen. Novena to Our Lady of Perpetual Help See at your feet, O Mother of Perpetual Help, a poor sinner who has recourse to you and confides in you. O Mother of Mercy, have pity on me. I hear you call the refuge and the hope of sinners. Be my refuge and my hope. Help me, for the love of Jesus Christ, stretch forth your hand to a poor fallen creature who recommends himself or herself to you and who devotes himself or herself to your service forever. I bless and thank Almighty God, who in his mercy had given me this confidence in you, which I hold to be a pledge of my eternal salvation. Mary, tender mother, help me. Mother of perpetual help, never allow me to lose my God. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without an Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without an Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without an Amen. 
Oh good St. Peregrine, patron of those suffering from foot ailments, cancer and incurable diseases, grant we beseech you relief from those who are ill. In your compassion, we beg you to intercede with our Lord Jesus Christ that mankind may soon find a cure for the dreaded disease of physical cancer as well as for the moral cancer which grieves so much of our world today. Amen. Reflection Repent for the kingdom of, the, of heaven is at hand. Prayer O great Saint Peregrine, who were yourself converted from a violent and sinful life, grant that those who have strayed from the way of, the, of Christ may like you be given the grace to repent and amend their ways. Amen. St. Peregrine, pray for us. St. Peregrine, inspired by your own example of repentance, patience, and humility, help us remain faithful to our resolution to walk with renewed strength and vigor in the ways of our Lord. And if God wills, please obtain a cure of the illness of those who are ill, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of Thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of Thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of Thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer Thee the most precious blood of Thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the masses sent throughout the world today for all the holy souls in purgatory, 
for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home, and within my family. Amen.